Blessings, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Patricia Lasky. If this is your first time here, welcome. Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Um, listen, I know that a lot of you are excited about getting married. I know that many of you, the Lord is calling you into marriage. You have already found your spouse. Well, one of the things that people don't think about is what marriage actually looks like. And I found a clip that I feel like is so powerful and so important, and I wanted to share it with you. So let's listen. Um, don't hate me, guys. I've been married a long time, and this is the truth. I think people assume they're ready for marriage because they're ready to get married. Don't get it twisted. I'm not doubting the power of your love. But if you're serious about marriage... I want to hear about something other than love. Love is the icing on a giant cake and sometimes it spreads too thin. People think love is an emotion when really it's a commitment. The heart Did you guys catch that? Love is a commitment. It's not an emotion. The hardest thing about commitment in marriage is it doesn't end. There's no break. The marriage exists even with the depths, the dismissals, the miscarriages, the diagnosis, the funerals and the fights. The question is no longer can I or you handle this, it is can we handle this. In marriage, everything is us. Till death do us part. Marriage. Till death do us part. No longer an I can we handle this. Just plunging into the deep end of the public swimming pool, holding onto your partner's hand when neither of you have learned how to swim yet. Marriage is not a sprint, guys, it's a marathon. Wow, that is so powerful because it's true. You know, I think people underestimate the process of the two becoming one. It requires the death of self so that the birth of we can come forward. It's not about who you were before. It's about who you are becoming together now. The Lord has hidden many blessings in marriage. Don't let anybody deceive you or discourage you about marriage. Marriage is a blessing and it is beautiful. And if you use the tools that God has given you, if you use the resources that he's given you, you can have a successful marriage. Until next time.